sometimes the world can get like a bit overwhelming. Like there's a lot going on and like technology and, and like, you know, just world events. I think that there's a part of us that kind of just wants to revert to like a little bit of a simpler time just to like tune out for a little minute. And I think that that's like that feeling of like, not only being in that time, but being at that age where, um, you know, you didn't really have too much responsibilities. Like your biggest worry was like, am I gonna miss Rocco's modern life? I think that I'd like to try and uh, encapture that feeling in my work. I just kind of like fell in love with the the different methods of hand building that there is like there's so many ways to create a piece and I think that there's just so much to learn and I think just like yeah discovering that world really um, yeah really got me into ceramics yeah the, the work that I was kind of doing down here on the Gold Coast was very um, it was very earthy and and boho um, which is great, but it isn't what, what I wanted to um, create. I love that it's just like nearly so much like patterns and color and just like the aesthetics are like nearly a bit too much. You can't like take it all in. Like I want stuff to be so eye blindingly like intense. Yeah. Like I'll just sit down with like some really childlike materials like textures or crayons or like pencils and I'll just like even sit in front of the TV and like doodle some things and just kind of like see what comes out and be really non-critical with what I'm um, putting down on the paper so that you kind of can tap into that like childlike brain a little bit and yeah I feel like that's how they they come across like a little bit joyous and a little bit silly because they are I just like I love creating and I'm like if I could make a living out of connecting and creating then yeah, I think that that's what I would love to do. I think that that's probably my biggest achievement is, um, yeah, having that, that self-belief. Because I think that's really hard. I think that's really hard to kind of, you know, especially after having such a stable income for such a long time, to have that faith to be like, wow, I don't know how this is going to work, but I believe it's going to work, and, and it has. Sometimes you just need to loosen up and just like play with the clay, like kind of see what happens and, you know, like even if I end up scrunching it into a ball afterwards, you know, it's still nice to like have that, um, that influence, I think, and, and just a different point of view.